what's going on guys let's look at this problem right here here this question is asking let the current density be j is equal to e power negative x cos 4 by a x plus e power negative x sin 4 by a y amperes per meter square determine the current crossing the surface x is equal to 2 and the y region is given by 0 to 5 by 3 and the z is going from 0 to 4 okay here they have mentioned the current crossing we are looking at the determine the current crossing surface x is equal to 2 so we only looking at ax we don't have ay or az if we have something like that that's going to be zero okay now we know that current equation is given by integral j ds okay so integrate in the surface j is current density that's provided so we can directly plug that one and find our final answer and uh, this is going to be and ds is equal to to dy dz in the x direction so ax i is equal to integral double integral e power negative x i am just copying the j that is current density e power negative x cos 4y ax plus e power negative x sine 4y ay and that's it and that's dy dz in the x direction and here you know that we have a y so we said that we are only looking at x direction if we have y or z direction that's going to be zero so this is zero so we are only left with this part we are going to have double integral e power negative x cos 4y a x let's avoid a x for now cos 4y and dy dz and that's going to be it and uh, first we are integrating with respect to y uh, y is going from 0 to 5 by 3 so the limits of integration is 0 to 5 by 3 and then z is going from 0 to 4 so this is going from 0 to 4 and after after you do the integration you are going to get something like this we know that x is equal to 2 so e power negative 2 and then if you integrate cos 4y that's going to become sine 4y divided by 4 then that's going from 0 to 5 by 3 and then integration respect to z is going to be integration if we integrate dz that's going to be just z so z is going from 0 to 4 and after we simplify this one i is going to be equal to e power negative 2 sine 4 phi divided by 3 so this is what we are getting after you simplify this one furthermore you are going to get 0 actually negative 0 point 117 ampere this negative represents current is flowing in the opposite direction okay that's how we do this kind of problems i hope this helps thanks for watching